Hey y'all, it's me Dorothy, and today I'm going to talk about how to understand Southern people. If you're from other parts of the United States or from other parts of the world, well, this is going to help you out. First of all, phrases. These are a lot of common things people don't understand with Southerners because we tend to push our words together. Like, uh, normally everybody else would be like, did you eat it? Well, Southerners would be like, did you eat it? You know, <laughs> we say stuff like that. Or uh, another phrase, hey y'all. And people are like, what's y'all? You know, some people actually don't understand that. In other words, hey everybody, or how's everybody doing, you know, or... And we use words that actually mean something else, but we totally use it for a different meaning, like sandwich. I got sandwiches stuck in my britches, like Jeff Foxworthy said. And, uh, you know, other stuff like that. And another thing about Southerners, we say hey. And people up north, y'all say yo. You know, yo, y'all, what's up, what's the deal, yo, hey, you guys. You know, stuff like that. I'm not picking at you guys. I'm, I'm just saying I'm trying to help people understand Southern. And <laughs> people tend to look at Southerners differently because of how we talk and how we say things. Like, you know, there's a lot of intelligent southern people that talk like they're totally not intelligent like I'm a smart person and I'll be like you know them them kids over there are, or if I'm describing something I'll be like well that thing over there people will be like what thing and I'm like that thing <laughs> you know people don't understand southerners but it's hard to you just gotta get to know a southerner and learn how Learn how they live their life, learn how they speak, learn their way of life, because we live life very differently. Compared to people up north, y'all eat apple pie with cheese, and down south we'd be like, Ugh, I ain't gonna eat that crap, you know? But down here we eat grits, and y'all probably don't eat that stuff either. I mean, it depends. People from other parts of the world, they'll be like, with the grit, you know. One time I remember I was at work and uh, there was this lady, she came from, she came from Hungary and I'm originally from Tennessee and I live in Florida now and I was asking this lady and her friend how y'all doing today and they did not understand a word I said because I'm, I mean they're from a different country and I, I wasn't even thinking about it because I'm just so used to talking the way I talk and they're like, excuse me? I'm like, how y'all doing today? And then my coworker had to jump in and be like, she asked, how are you doing? And it was really funny because after, after they left, he laughed and he was like, when people are from other countries, you got to talk to them normally. And I'm like, well, I'm from the South. <laughs> we study Southerners and hang around one to understand how we talk. We, we're different. We, we just are. It reminds me of so much goofy stuff that has happened to me throughout my life when I've met people from up north. Like the, the two couples, I used to work at a Kroger one time back in Tennessee. And one couple was from up north and one was from down south. And the northern guy and the southern guy were together and, uh, the southern guy was like, hey, get this girl a buggy. And the northern guy was like, it's not a buggy, it's a shopping cart. <laughs> I mean, they, they just don't understand. We use different words and phrases for things. And uh, Another time, a guy from New Jersey came through the line at Kroger. And uh, I was like, y'all have a good day. And he started laughing. And I'm like, what's so funny? He's like, that y'all killed me. And he was just laughing. He, he meant well. I mean, that's why you gotta travel and get to know different people and learn about different cultures. Because, you know, there's a lot of different neat things you can learn, you know. I mean, I'd like to go travel the world someday and learn about what, what people do in different countries. 
how they live their life differently. And I even want to go up north sometime and, you know, understand more how they live. I mean, people from the north seem pretty nice because, like, I moved to Florida almost, it'll be two years ago, this coming August, and I've met so many northerners and just learning about how they talk and react with each other is a totally different world from when I lived in Tennessee. I mean, it's kind of ironic, even though I live in Florida now, there's so many northerners down here. It's like the retire person state. They all come down here. I want to enjoy the, I want to, I want to enjoy the sun before I die. You know, that kind of thing. Well, we moved down here too, but we just wanted to get away from Tennessee. But that's a whole other story. So, yeah, I just want to share that with y'all today. So, feel free to comment, like my video, feel free to subscribe, and maybe if you have ideas on different types of blogs you'd like to see or a subject you'd like to hear about, go ahead and shoot me a message. I'd be happy to talk with you. Have a wonderful day. God bless you. Bye.